This is my video for Project for Awesome, and my charity is the Invisible Children, and it helps children in northern Uganda who have been displaced. You don't even understand how hard it is for me to talk about this charity. I get really genuinely upset. And I know that sounds melodramatic and stupid, but I honestly do. <laughs> you should have an understanding that I'm not going to cover even half of what I really want to say about this charity because I'm horrible at talking. How do you tell someone about something you don't understand? Like you really can't honestly comprehend how it's happening or why it's happening. And how do you tell them that you need it to be fixed when you yourself don't know the exact solution? Invisible Children is a charity that helps people in northern Uganda where thousands of families have already been displaced, taken from their homes, everything ripped away just because of a war that they can't even control. I just think it's extremely sick to think about how kids in my high school every day are continuously whining and bitching basically about smallest things that people in these camps would kill for. They would kill to get that geometry project. They would love to write that essay in English. But here, God forbid we appreciate anything. God forbid we appreciate that we have a bed to sleep in, that we have food on the table at night. No, we have to ask for more and more and more when these kids have never had any of that. We continuously whine and cry about all the little petty things in life while these kids are continuously smiling and cheering and just so glad to be alive because maybe their best friend didn't make it through the night because they didn't have any food for the past longest while. And maybe their mom, they don't know where their mom went because she went to go work on the streets one night and never came back. It's little things like that that make me really feel horribly selfish every day. Like, what I really don't understand is how people here really aren't doing anything about it. Like, the only difference between you and those people who just have lost everything is where you were born. How does where you were born decide whether you have the right to live or not? Like, the right to life, like a proper... Like, I understand we're both living, but the proper right to have family and be happy, you know, I really can't process it. And I, so I got this shirt from the Invisible Children charity, and it's really actually kind of totally adorable. And I wouldn't buy shirts like this usually, but now I actually kind of really like them, which is a plus. And every time you wear this shirt, someone will ask you, what does that say? I, every time I wear the shirt, someone asks, what is my heart is beeping? And they're completely confused. And it's kind of really cool. So, it looks like this. Do you see it? And there's little hearts. Look. My heart is beeping for the invisible children. Why not help? And make a fashion statement at the same time. I generally don't know how what to say and how to explain an entire charity in a few minute video, so I'm not going to try to. Instead, I'm just going to tell you to go to the link in the sidebar and help someone out. Change someone's life today. I'm really hoping someone checks out the charity and maybe donates. You don't even have to donate, you can just look at it. Check it out. Invisible children. Help displace children today. <laughs> You're kind of awesome.
If you have